Hello YouTube, Wes here checking in with a brand new video for you. This time we're talking about CD finds from the past few months. We're talking call this one spring 2019. Pretty slow just because we were moving and everything at first and then uh, just in the past week about I had two days at Goodwill where I just got literally a couple hundred CDs. Uh, just a crazy collection came in and I had to take the opportunity when I had a chance and so yeah I went from a small stack I got in the past couple months to a pretty large pile here so let's just go ahead and get into this this is gonna take a while uh, grab a beverage uh, I'm drinking a little LaCroix not a sponsor it's my favorite flavor the the cola flavor uh, so let's go ahead and get into it I'll first talk about a couple of new CDs I picked up in the past month um, that was, or the past, not the past month, in springtime, um, I picked up Hozier's new album, Wasteland Baby. Just picked this up on CD. Do enjoy Hozier and uh, wanted, to, wanted to have that in the collection. And then I've been picking up these uh, remastered editions of Metallica albums that they're doing. Uh, so I got the remastered in Justice for All. They're doing these nice little sort of mini LP style uh, packaging so pick that one up uh, so those were the two the two new cds i picked up uh, in the past couple months so let's go ahead and get into a couple of used cds i picked up here and there different thrift stores and whatnot got a copy of dennis leary's lock and load had that on cassette a long time ago and enjoyed it it's been a long time since i heard it and it's a really good it's a really good one so wanted to pick that up uh, the soundtrack to the movie train spotting Maxwell MTV Unplugged, still sealed. Uh, Andrew Bird's Bowl of Fire, Thrills. Uh, Roxy Music Avalon. Uh, original Gangsta's soundtrack. Uh, Holes Celebrity Skin. Billy Idol's Rebel Yell. Goody Mob, One Monkey Don't Stop No Show. Uh, Lucinda Williams, World Without Tears, Simple Minds, Real Life, uh, Now That's What I Call Music 21, U.S. version. Um, here's a Miami-based thing, so it might not be well too well known, but this is uh, K-Nock, Escape from Quad City. K-Nock was part of 95 South. Uh, Mike and the Mechanics, Beggar on a Beach of Gold. Uh, the Weekend, I guess this is his self-titled one. Uh, Rihanna, Rated R. And Dave Matthews Band, The Best of What's Around, Volume 1. Um, so those were just sort of my random CD pickups over the springtime. So all the rest you're going to see are all from, what I, like I said, two days at Goodwill. Uh, just crazy, crazy cool collection. Got blues, classic rock, jazz, all kinds of cool stuff. Just killer stuff, more the, much better than the normal sort of schlocky kind of stuff I pick up. So let's just go ahead and get into this. Uh, speaking of blues, picked up a bunch of these Blues Masters uh, collections that they did on Rhino Records. This is Volume 5, Jump Blues Classics. Tommy by The Who. Uh, another Lucinda Williams. This is live at the Fillmore. Uh, Nirvana, this is a compilation. Uh, Led Zeppelin 2. Uh, Neil Young and Crazy Horse, Rust Never Sleeps. Uh, Neil Young Unplugged. Neil Young and Crazy Horse, Weld. Two disc set. Uh, Grinderman or Grinderman, not sure how that's pronounced. A nice two disc Prince compilation titled Ultimate Prince. Uh, John Lennon, Once Upon a Time. Um, here's a cool one. David Bowie, David Live. And these are fold out and they give all the, the tour dates. And then you, know, you get your two discs. And all kinds of all kinds of really nice uh, stuff in there. So yeah, those are some really nice packages. There's another one of these coming. I'm sure you can guess what that's going to be. If you're familiar with the David Bowie discography, uh, Blitz and Trapper with Seven, Bob Dylan, Hard Rain, uh, Neil Young and Crazy Horse, Mansion on the Hill, it's just a single, uh, nice DVD, two CD set, REM Live,
Eric Clapton's Pilgrim. Uh, Neil Young and Crazy Horse Zuma. Neil Young Living with War. Uh, Neil Young Are You Passionate? Uh, Nina Simone, The Blues, compilation here on Novus. And The Who's Quadrophenia. Um, Elvis Costello and the Attractions, Armed Forces, two CD set of that, so a lot of outtakes and stuff like that on there. Uh, Joan Baez, Diamonds and Rust. Uh, Bruce Springsteen, E Street Band, Live in Dublin. Uh, John Fogarty's Blue Moon Swamp. The Allman Brothers Band, Brothers and Sisters. Got that on vinyl. Brian Wilson presents Smile. Nice, uh, nice sort of packaging there with the slipcase and the thick book and everything in there. So it's pretty nice. Uh, Otis Redding, Remember Me. So Otis Redding compilation there. Um, Almond Brothers Band, Eat a Peach. Uh, REM's Murmur. Uh, Almond Brothers Band, Shades of Two Worlds. Almond Brothers Band, An Evening with the Almond Brothers Band. Lots of, lots of live Almond Brothers stuff in here. Um, here's Greg Almond solo, Low Country Blues. I think that was his next to last album, or his last album. I don't remember exactly. I remember that one's pretty recent. Uh, Greg Almond's Laid Back. Uh, here's the other David Bowie I alluded to, and this one, of course, is Stage. Similar packaging where it fold, folds out. This one folds out into a long, long thing there. But uh, once again, really, really nicely detailed. And this one I do have on vinyl as well, so that's pretty cool. Uh, Johnny Cash, American Three, Solitary Man, and Johnny Cash, American Four, The Man Comes Around. The band Stage Fright, uh, Moondog Matinee by the band, Bob Dylan Self Portrait, uh, Jimi Hendrix South Saturn Delta, that's a good one, I do have that one on vinyl as well, uh, Neil Young Self Titled, uh, The Birds Play Dylan. Jackson Brown's The Pretender, favorite of mine, and The Bird's Sweetheart of the Rodeo. Uh, next up, Van Morrison, It's Too Late to Stop Now, that live, uh, live concert recording that I had on vinyl. I showed it in a recent uh, Vinyl Survivor series, I believe. Unfortunately, the quality wasn't good enough to keep that. Um, next up, Stevie Ray Vaughan in Double Trouble, the Real Deal Greatest Hits Volume 2. So nice Stevie Ray Vaughan there. Uh, Neil Young and Crazy Horse Ragged Glory. Uh, Miles Davis Tribute to Jack's, Jack Johnson. Uh, Neil Young and Crazy Horse Mirrorball. That's a classic one. Or just, I guess, Neil Young by himself Mirrorball. Uh, this one was cool. I hadn't seen this one before. I, I do have, I've had the first version of this, first it, volume of this for a long time since it came out, basically. Uh, Beach Boys Greatest Hits, this is volume two. Uh, so you get 20 more uh, Beach Boys tracks. Pretty cool compilation. Volume one is really good, really uh, enjoyable. A uh, copy of Neil Young's Decade. So I do have that on vinyl as well. Uh, the Rolling Stones Bridges of Babylon. Cool slip case on that one. John Coltrane live at Birdland on Impulse. Nice sort of fold out packaging on those. Uh, REM Dead Letter Office. Neil Young's Freedom. And the 
face is. A wink is as good as a... Oh, a nod is as good as a wink to a blind horse. Uh, Led Zeppelin BBC Sessions. Crosby, Stills, Nash & Young, Four Way Street. Awesome, awesome live concert. Pretty easy to find on vinyl. Absolutely a must have. Uh, REM live at the Olympia in Dublin, 39 songs, and nice two CD live set. Uh, Harry Nilsson, all time greatest tits. Van Morrison's Tupelo Honey. Nice two, two, two for uh, Nina Simone. This has got uh, the amazing Nina Simone and live, or uh, yeah, live at Town Hall. Traffic, smiling phases. Um, Neil Young, Road Rock, Friends and Relatives, Road Rock, Volume 1, I haven't seen that one before, uh, Neil Young and Crazy Horse, Greendale, Albert King and Stevie Ray Vaughan in session, I recently got rid of this because mine was a burned copy and I got rid of all my burned stuff and uh, so now I have a real one, so that's pretty cool to have that back, uh, Bob Dylan, Times They Are Changing. Uh, here's a really cool one, uh, the Trojan Dub box set. So, you know, three CD set of Trojan uh, records, you know, dub dub reggae kind of stuff. So really, really cool. Uh, just a pretty simple box here with three little, three little discs in there. Uh, but yeah, that was a cool find. Uh, the Robert Glasper Experiment, Black Radio. Richard and Linda Thompson, I want to see the bright lights tonight. Uh, Miles Davis, Nefertiti. Miles Davis, ESP. Uh, Jimmy Page and the Black Crows live at the Burt, or live at the Creek. Live at the Greek. Not the creek. <laughs> uh, Almond Brothers Band live at Nassau Coliseum, 5173. Uh, Frank Zappa, have I offended someone? A nice 2LP comp, The Essential Clash. Uh, of course, the classic something else, Cannonball Adderley. Classic jazz album there. Uh, here's R.L. Burnside, Burnside on Burnside. Uh, another one of the Blues Masters series. This is Volume 8, Mississippi Delta Blues. Miles Davis at Newport, 1958. Uh, Patty Smith, Land, 1975 to 2002. So I'm guessing this is a compilation. Uh, the American Folk Blues Festival, 1962 to 66. So a lot of uh, Howlin' Wolf, Junior Wells, T-Bone Walker, a bunch of bunch of Sonny Boy Will Williamson, a bunch of artists on there. Uh, the Kinks, uh, Lola versus Power Man. Think about that for a second. Coltrane plays the blues. Uh, Zappa and the Mothers, Roxy and Elsewhere. And this is kind of an odd one. It says on the spine, Rolling Stones tattoo you, but it's actually some girls. <laughs> uh, yeah, so somehow that got mixed up and I was never able to find uh, the others to sort of put that right, but kind of weird uh, import thing with a little LP that slides out. Hadn't seen that before. Thought I would go ahead and grab that pretty nicely done. Uh, Cash American 5, 100 Highways. And these are ones I had burns as well. And it's cool to have, uh, finally have physical copies of them. Was a lot of them I did have burns of and, and got rid of them. Uh, this was just sort of a blind buy. It looked interesting. I had to grab it. Uh, Old Man Ladiki, Tender is the Night. Uh, yeah, just. Sounded like it might be something sort of nice, indie, soft rock kind of stuff that I might like. Uh, 
Ennio Morricone, 40, or 50 movie theme hits, so a nice uh, three CD compilation of Ennio Morricone. Uh, Stevie Ray Vaughan, Couldn't Stand the Weather. And had to sneak one of these in there. And now that's what I call Christmas, two CD set, Christmas music. I don't think that was part of this collection. Doesn't fit in with the rest of these. Uh, the Lonious Monk Quartet with John Coltrane at Carnegie Hall. Tom Petty's Highway Companion. And Jason Isbell's Sirens of the Ditch. We're getting there, folks. This is going faster than I thought it would, so we're, we're going to get there. Uh, this is just titled Music by Ry Cooter, so I'm guessing this is a compilation, two CD set of Ry Cooter stuff. Uh, Bruce Springsteen, The Seeger Sessions, we'll sh We Shall Overcome. I do have this on vinyl. It's amazing, so definitely wanted to have it on CD. I think there's a DVD in here. Yeah, there's a DVD in here that has the concert and stuff. And, uh, really cool find there. This is another one that was kind of a blind buy, but definitely looks like blues to me. Robert Randolph and the Family Band, live at the Wetlands. Another Blues Masters. This is Volume 3, Texas Blues. Uh, Neil Young's Fork in the Road. Jimi Hendrix, Valleys of Neptune. Uh, Jimmy Page and Robert Plant, No Quarter. Tom Petty and the Heartbreakers, Echo. Uh, the Best of the Electric Flag. Uh, R.E.M.'s Life's Rich Pageant. Uh, Blues Masters Volume 2, Post-War Chicago. R.E.M.'s Around the Sun. Uh, Ray Charles, Genius Loves Company. And the Newport Folk Festival, Best of the Blues, 1959 to 68, three CD set on Vanguard Records. That's very cool. And Blues Masters Volume 1, Urban Blues. As you can see, I pretty much got the whole set of these, I think. Uh, Ray Charles Blues and Jazz. Uh, nice two CD set there. Pretty cool. Uh, here's one I know a lot of people have raved about in the in the music community here. This is uh, Dennis Wilson, Pacific Ocean Blue. Nice little package there with the, lots of photos and liner notes and nice thick booklet and everything here. So two CD set of that. That should be pretty awesome. Uh, Miles Davis Quintet, uh, live at the Monterey Jazz Festival, 1963. R.E.M. Collapse Into Now, John Coltrane's Lush Life, uh, Allison Krauss and Union Station Live, nice two CD set there, uh, the best of Ray Charles, The Atlantic Years, uh, Muddy Mississippi Waters Live, nice two disc set of this, I think it's two discs, yeah. It's a nice live concert, Muddy Waters. Jackson Brown, Saturate Before Using. And Elvis Presley, Self-Titled. Some bonus tracks on it. And Johnny Cash, Unchained. Buddy Guy, damn right I've got the blues. Clash, Sandinista, have that one on vinyl, it's a good album, really cool stuff on there. Uh, John Coltrane, Ballads, Impulse, so this is a two-disc two set as well. The band, music from Big Pink, this is a remastered version of this, thought I'd grab it. Uh, Blues Masters Volume 4, Harmonica Classics. Uh, this is the soundtrack, I guess, to Be Here to Love Me, a film, by Town, a film about Towns Van Zandt, two-disc set. Uh, 
buddy guy in Junior Wells last time around live at Legends. Lou Reed, Rock and Roll Animal. Dolly Parton, Little Sparrow. Almond Brothers Band live at the Fillmore. The Who, the kids are all right. The Who live at Leeds. George Harrison, Band of Horses. Uh, the Band, High on the Hog. John Mayall and the Bru bleh, and the Blues Breakers. Um, Allman Brothers Band, Wipe the Windows, Check the Gas. Allman Brothers Band, Hitting the Note. Joan Baez, Bowery Songs. Uh, Almond Brothers Band, Seven Turns. Almond Brothers Band, live at, at SUNY at, at Stony Brook, uh, 9 1971. Two CD set of that concert. Uh, the band, self titled, remastered. Almond Brothers Band, live at the Atlanta International Pop Festival, uh, 1970, it looks like. All right, next up, Bob Dylan biograph, three CD set. This this originally would have come in a come in a LP sized box, but don't have the box, just the three CDs. So that's but that's still nice to have this uh, biograph collection. Uh, Beatles anthology two, uh, got all three of this set. Um, I picked these up before. I'll just figure out what I have and what I don't have, and kind of make a full set of those. Uh, David Bowie, Ziggy Stardust, uh, David Bowie, Hunky Dory, The Band, To Kingdom Come, uh, Almond Brothers Band, Macon County, or Macon City Auditorium, 211.72, two disc set, live set there, uh, Beatles Anthology 3, uh, Public Enemy, Apocalypse 91, Enemy Strikes Back, or Black, Enemy Strikes Black, uh, Kate Bush, Central World, or not the Central World, the whole story. Uh, Joni Mitchell, Turbulent Indigo. Lou Reed, NYC Man, The Collection. That's a nice uh, Lou Reed compilation. Uh, Miles Davis, The Best of Seven Steps, 1963-64. to Miles Davis, Quiet Nights with Gil Evans. And here is a LP I recently raved about, and I'm glad to have it on CD, so I can take it with me. Uh, Van Morrison's uh, Veed and Fleece, killer, killer album. Love that one. Uh, Miles Davis, Files de Kilimanjaro. Lucinda Williams, Car Wheels on a Gravel Road. This is a deluxe version, two CD set. Cool. Uh, John Coltrane, My Favorite Things. Uh, Neil Young, Chrome Dreams 2. Blues Masters Volume 6, Blues Originals. Uh, Blues Masters Volume 12, Mississippi Blues. Blues Masters Volume 14, More Jump Blues. Blues Masters Volume 11, Classic Women's Blues, or Classic Blues Women's. Uh, Blues Masters Volume 7, Revival Blues. Muddy Waters at Newport, 1960. Uh, Miles Davis, Bags Groove. Uh, another Nuggets compilation. This is Nuggets from Nuggets. On Rhino, some more psychedelic 60s psych stuff. Uh, Blues Masters Volume 15, Slide Guitar Classics. Miles Davis, Highlights from the Plugged Nickel. Tom Petty and the Heartbreakers, She's the One. Uh, Paint It Blues, or, or Paint It Blue, Songs of the Rolling Stones. This is a Rolling Stones sort of thing that they did at House of Blues. So you got a bunch of, uh, bunch of blues artists doing Rolling Stones songs, so kind of turning that whole thing around, where the Rolling Stones would do you know, rock re remakes of blues songs. These are blues artists doing Rolling Stones songs. Um, 
John Coltrane, I love Supreme. Really nice to have this on CD. I had it on vinyl, of course. That's a that's one of those ones you you must have on vinyl, uh, but it's cool to have it on CD as well. Uh, Miles Davis, Sorcerer, Bloomfield, Cooper, and Stills, Super Sessions. And last but not least, Neil Young, Comes a Time on CD. Have that one on vinyl as well. So that was my huge, massive CD haul from really just from two days at Goodwill. Uh, huge, as I said, huge collection came in. I had to take the chance, had to take the opportunity when I had the chance to to grab as, as many of those as I could, because uh, I know this is all good stuff and some of it I have heard and some of it I haven't. Uh, so yeah, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Leave me some comments down below. Subscribe to the channel if you aren't already and uh, do lots of music related stuff here and I think you'll enjoy it. Have a great day, great night, and we'll see you again real soon. Cheers.